Ah, the 70s and 80s, a time of big hair, disco beats, and some truly unforgettable eats. Let's rewind the clock for a moment and imagine a time when bell-bottom jeans were all the rage and disco balls lit up the dance floor. It was an era defined not only by its vibrant fashion and foot-tapping music, but also by its distinctive culinary delights. In today's episode, we're going to take a delicious trip down memory lane, revisiting some iconic dishes that graced the dinner tables in the UK and USA during this vibrant era. From the comforting simplicity of shepherd's pie to the delights of trifle, we'll count down the top 10 foods that defined the 70s and 80s. Each dish, a nostalgic taste of history, a testament to the culinary trends that shaped a generation. So brace yourselves as we take a delightful journey back in time through your taste buds. Kicking off our countdown at number 10 is the ever-popular Angel Delight. This whimsical dessert hails from the United Kingdom, with its roots firmly planted in the 70s. What made Angel Delight so special? Well, it's a dessert that doubles as a fun science experiment. Just add milk to the powder, whisk it up, and voila! You've got yourself a bowl of fluffy, sweet delight. And let's not forget its iconic advertising slogan, Whip Up an Angel Delight, a phrase that brought a chuckle to households across the UK. Its unique texture, variety of flavors, and the sheer joy of making it made Angel Delight a standout dessert of the era. From butterscotch to strawberry, there was a flavor for everyone's taste buds. Ah, sweet nostalgia. It's not just a dessert, it's a trip down memory lane. Indeed, a delicious start to our retro food journey. Moving forward, at number 9 we have the beloved fish and chips. Originating from the United Kingdom, this classic dish is a delightful medley of crispy golden fish fillets and piping hot chips. The harmony of flavors and textures is simply irresistible. As an old British ad used to say, nothing says home like fish and chips. Those of us old enough to remember will recall the fish and chip van on a Friday afternoon and being sent out with an order. Nothing tasted better than fish and chips on a Friday eaten straight from the paper of course with lots of salt and vinegar. Next up, at number 8, is Spam. This tinned meat was popular in both the UK and USA. During World War II, Spam's reach made its way to England and the countries of the Asian Pacific, where rationing and the presence of American troops saw the meat become a menu staple. Having the sort of food that can survive in the tropical heat and be kept on a shelf for weeks and months was a huge boon. The evolution definitely started in the 60s where it became more of an ingredient. It was used for sandwiches and as an ingredient in eggs. It became a meat substitute in the 70s and was often used as part of a meal. Spam, you either love it or hate it. At number 7, we have a food that is truly a blast from the past, the iconic prawn cocktail. Originating from the United Kingdom, this delightful starter was a staple in every 70s dinner party. With its combination of succulent prawns, tangy cocktail sauce, and crisp lettuce, it was truly a taste sensation. Who could forget the ad that proclaimed, Prawn Cocktail, the party starter that never goes out of style. Moving on to number 6, we're crossing the pond to the United States. Here, we find the unforgettable Hamburger Helper. The Hamburger Helper brand was introduced to the rest of the United States in the summer of 1971. This box of culinary convenience, with its playful glove mascot, helped many a family whip up a quick and satisfying meal. The ad jingle still rings in our ears, Hamburger Helper, making dinner a time to remember. These two foods are sure to have stirred up some tasty memories. Cracking into our top five, we have the Fray Bentos pie made in the UK. Created in the second half of the 19th century, the name is derived from the port of Fray Bentos in Uruguay, where the products were originally processed and packaged until the 1960s. The brand is now owned in the UK by Baxter's, which manufactures the product range in Scotland. This delightful pie was the crown jewel of many a family dinner in the 70s. Its unique crispy pastry was a hit among kids and adults alike. Strangely, it came packaged in a tin. Moving on at number four, we have the iconic Pop-Tarts from the United States. Introduced in the 60s, these toaster pastries gained immense popularity in the following decades. With a sweet filling sealed inside a thin pastry crust, Pop-Tarts became the go-to breakfast for many a busy morning. And how about that classic ad line, so hot they're cool, so cool they're hot, Pop-Tarts. What a delightful duo we have here, each with its unique charm and taste. Now we're really getting into the iconic tastes of the past. And now, the third spot on our list goes to the delectable shepherd's pie from the United Kingdom. Originating from the hearty kitchens of Northern England and Scotland, this savory dish combines minced meat and veggies, 
topped off with a golden crust of mashed potatoes. Remember that classic ad? Shepherd's pie, the taste of home that never fails to satisfy. Moving on, the second spot is claimed by none other than the iconic bird's trifle. This iconic trifle was popular with British families served as a traditional dessert on a Sunday afternoon. It came in a box with all the necessary ingredients and instructions. The fun part was mixing it together to see the final result. Who can remember the classic Friends episode where Rachel got the pages stuck together and made half shepherd's pie and half trifle? From savory to sweet, these foods have left a lasting legacy on our taste buds. We're getting closer to our number one. Can you guess what it might be? And finally, the moment you've all been waiting for, our number one food from the 70s and 80s is none other than the iconic Twinkie. They've been featured in movies, TV shows, and even court cases. And who could forget the legendary Twinkie defense? But what really sets the Twinkie apart is the nostalgia it evokes. Just one bite and you're transported back to simpler times when the biggest decision of the day was whether to eat your Twinkie now or save it for later. And let's not forget the memorable ad campaigns that have accompanied the Twinkie over the years. Who can resist the charm of Twinkie the Kid, the brand's cowboy mascot, who promised that you get a big delight in every bite of Hostess Twinkies? That catchphrase has certainly stood the test of time and is still remembered fondly by many. In the end, the Twinkie's enduring appeal lies in its simplicity. It's a humble sponge cake filled with cream, but for many of us, it represents comfort, nostalgia, and a taste of childhood. The Twinkie is more than just a snack. It's a piece of our history, a symbol of an era gone by, and most importantly, it's delicious. A well-deserved winner, wouldn't you agree? There you have it, a delicious stroll down memory lane with the top 10 foods from the 70s and 80s. From the UK's comforting shepherd's pie to the USA's iconic Twinkies, we've revisited the tastes that defined two vibrant decades. Let's take a quick rewind. We kicked off with the 10th spot, the hearty shepherd's pie, a British classic that's been warming hearts and bellies since time immemorial. Then to the ninth spot, where we savored the American hamburger helper, the savior of weeknight dinners. With the eighth spot, we crossed the pond for the quintessential British fish and chips, a seaside staple. Let's not forget there were many more iconic foods, such as the popular party favorite cheese fondue, which was a fun dipping food for small gatherings. There are many party foods, who can forget the cheese and pineapple, always a favorite at social gatherings. Each of these foods carries a unique story, a distinct flavor that takes us back to the good old days. They're not just foods, they're time capsules, preserving the taste of yesteryears. Despite the emergence of new culinary trends, these dishes and snacks continue to hold a special place in our hearts and our palates for their nostalgic value. So whether you're a fan of the 70s or the 80s, British or American, sweet or savory, there's something for everyone in this delicious countdown. And the best part? These retro flavors are just as scrumptious today as they were back then. Thank you for joining us on this tasty journey. Until next time, keep savoring those retro flavors. If you have any favorites, please feel free to comment below. Remember to like and subscribe for more of 10 of the best, there is always something new.